hello students now in 3d visualization in 3d visualization the very next important topic is faces edges and vertices faces edges and vertices here a polyhedron can be described by its faces edges and vertices now what is face face is a flat surface of the solid flat surface now we are writing on a whiteboard the whiteboard is a flat surface it is also a face of a solid okay a flat surface of the solid face is a flat surface of a solid and now vertex 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 is a corner or a point where three or more faces meet it is a corner or a point where three or more faces meet is a vertex and now third and important thing edges what is edge here it is a line segment edge is a line segment where two faces meet where two faces meet here now we will dis we will discuss with an example what is face and what is vertex and what is edges here let us take an example of cube here i'm drawing a cube okay now i am naming the cube a b c d e f and g h here it is a cube it has first how many faces first is face right how many faces are there in a cube 1 2 3 top one sides two okay front and back four and five four and five front and back and bottom is six top one sides two and three front and back is four and five and sixth one is bottom one six face so how many faces are there six faces and each face each figure is a square each figure is a square now vertex after faces what we had discussed in the definition vertex so vertex how many vertices are there it has eight vertices eight vertices how we will know this is eight vertices here a b c d e f g h okay what how many letters are there 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 One, two, three, four, four, five, six, seven, eight. So eight letters. So how many vertices are there? Eight vertices. What is a 
what is a vertex definition point how many points are there one two three four four points on the top and four points on the bottom so how many vertices are there eight vertices or namely what are the vertices a b c d e f g h okay now next final thing edges what is the definition of edges line segment it is a line segment where two faces meet so here how many faces are there six faces so how many edges it should be 12 two faces meet there is a line segment okay there is one edge six faces so 12 edges okay now what are the edges here a b is one line segment right b c second one c d d a e f f g g h h e and then a e b e b f c g and d h so total 12 edges are there 12 edges namely a b b c c d d a e f f g g h h e a e b f c g and d h so by using this now we understood what is face what is vertex and what is edge and how we will derive faces edges and vertices for a given three-dimensional figure and now the next very important topic is nets of 3d objects nets of 3d objects how we will derive a nut of a 3d object net figure how we will net means opened figure normally the figures are closed figures so when we will open that figure how the figure it looks like that we have to identify again i'm drawing a cube Okay, this is a cube. As I told you earlier, there are six faces in the cube. Okay, so when we open and each face is a square. So when we open the net of this cube, so each face should be a square. So here, top, bottom, sides, four, and front and back. Okay, so I'm opening the top one. So top now back and then bottom okay now right right side okay and then left left side and then front when we will open a picture open any shape of any solid shape so according to the shape if it is a cube then we will because cube is having a six faces and each face is looks like a square if we open a cuboid then how we will draw the net of the figure by using a rectangle because cuboid uh, faces are resembles like a rectangle by using rectangle okay so according to the given shape of the 3d object that um, we can draw the net of the figure 
this is not the final one net of the figure by using this we can draw net of a 3d object in 11 different ways so any and when any one of the way we can use and we can draw a net of a 3d object clear